Hey everyone, welcome back to The Road to Superman. This is episode 49, and today we may have some incredibly surprising and exciting news. The Superman movie may be having a teaser trailer releasing this week, and James Gunn has given further evidence towards this possibly being true. So, at the end of this week, New York Comic Con is happening, an event I completely forgot about. Now, DC's slate for the event has been revealed, and we can see that on all three days, they have something going on. On Thursday, they have a Penguin event, a Bats in Translation event, and DC Gotham City event. So Thursday is very Batman related. Then on Friday, they only have one event called DC's Absolute All In. And then on Saturday, they have Jim Lee and Friends and then a Creature Commandos event to end their time at New York Comic Con. Now I think on Thursday and Saturday, it's pretty clear what they're going to talk about. But on Friday, they have an hour and 15 minute long event about DC's Absolute All In. I have no idea what that is about, but I think if they were going to release a Superman teaser, that would be the time to do it. The DCU is going all in on DC, and what is the movie that will kick it all off? Superman. Not only that, but I believe James Gunn will be at New York Comic Con to show off Creature Commandos on Saturday. So making an appearance the day before on Friday to show off Superman would actually make sense too. He has been asked questions for months now about when we will be getting a trailer for the Superman movie, and so far, he hasn't really ever answered it. He either ignores it entirely, or says not for a long time now. But just a few days ago, he did actually say something a bit more interesting. One user asked, James Gunn, are we getting a Superman teaser or trailer before the end of the year? And Gunn simply replied with the thinking emoji. Now that is interesting. Why would he respond to that question now with just a non-definitive emoji? For me, based on previous experiences with directors being vague or teasing future trailers, they only ever do that when the teaser is very close to it actually being released. They want to hype up the hardcore fans who follow these updates closely, but obviously don't outright say it's going to happen. So this could be what Gunn is doing here. Since production of Superman began, people have been asking him when the trailer is going to come out, and he either doesn't answer it or says not for a long time. So him now giving a vague and teasing answer would imply that we are pretty close now. Now, very close could actually be Brazil CCXP in December, which we discussed previously, and I think that is most likely the destination for the first teaser for the Superman movie. But it could also be this Friday at New York Comic Con. And what could give further evidence to this being the case is knowing how far along the post-production process they are. BSL stated, the movie is in post-production to the point where I'm told there's an assembly cut done. And Gunn responded to this claim stating, Oh, the assembly cut was done a long ago. Now that is mental. They only finished production at the end of July, and apparently they completed an assembly cut of the film long ago, so probably over a month ago, which is insane for a movie of this scale. And I think that means they are ahead of schedule. And this is the beauty of Gunn's preparation. You may not like his films, but you have to give him credit for the amount of time he is given for this movie to be created. The planning has been phenomenal. And if some of you don't know what an assembly cut is, it's basically where in post-production they stitch all the footage together to create the first cut of the movie, and then after this they start trimming down scenes and colour grading and so on. And because Gunn has been sending shots over just after they've been filmed to their VFX team, they probably have quite a few shots with complete CGI already. And yet again, that is mental. And so if they are further along in post-production than we originally thought, they are probably also further along in terms of planning their promotional campaign, and so maybe it will begin sooner than expected. They've known the rough outlook of the film for probably over a month with the assembly cuts being complete, but within that, they also have solid CGI shots too. So I reckon they are probably either working on a teaser now for December's CCXP, or they have already created one that will be released this Friday at New York Comic Con. But why would they release a teaser this October instead of December, which would be closer to the film's release? Well, one reason they may choose to release it this Friday is to get ahead of their competition. Fantastic Four and Jurassic World Rebirth both release in the same month and already have revealed a first look at their movies 
and their logos. But they finished filming after Superman. So on the production side, Superman is ahead, but on the promotion side, Superman is technically behind them. Sure, we had our first look at the Superman suit during production and obviously set photos too, but other than the first photo, nothing official has come out marketing-wise. No official poster or logo or any screen caps from the film. Just one Superman photo since production began. So New York Comic Con may be the perfect time to get ahead of the competition. Releasing a 20-second to one minute long teaser that just shows off some exciting official shots from the movie can really get fans engaged and impressed with what they are making. Not only that, but releasing a 20 second long teaser this Friday means you could have a one minute teaser released at CCXP in December that this New York teaser sets up. So it's a teaser within a teaser, and I think that could actually work. I was initially worried that this would be too soon to release any form of teaser, but maybe it isn't if it is literally just a 20 second teaser. And that, along with a logo reveal at New York, would be a brilliant start. Then at CCXP they could reveal the full one minute teaser with an official poster for the film as well, meaning you get incredible Superman promotion at both events. Because I think it would be a real waste if they were going to New York Comic Con with James Gunn being there and we don't get anything from Superman. Let's face it, yes, Creature Commandos is the first DCU project and they are promoting that at New York Comic Con, but no one is really hyper-focused on that show. Maybe the real super hardcore DC fans are, but most of us are focused on Superman. That is what we are truly excited for. So for them to not utilize both Comic Cons to give us something Superman related would be a real shame. Or is that just the fan in me wanting Superman footage as soon as possible? Maybe it is best for them to hold out on any Superman footage until December. However, DC is at an interesting point right now. Whilst Joker 2 has been really failing, The Penguin is becoming one of the most popular shows in the world right now, and the Superman Christopher Reeve documentary is releasing soon too, with a lot of praise and love surrounding it, and Superman and Lois Season 4 is coming out weekly now as well. So maybe it might be worth utilizing the love DC has right now, especially with Superman, and expand that praise with a bit of Superman footage this weekend. I just think whilst the Superman hype is strong with Christopher Reeve's documentary and Superman and Lois season 4, they can utilize that love for the character to their advantage, and New York Comic Con could be the perfect place for a short 20 second teaser for their new Superman movie. It doesn't have to be much, and you know fans will be analyzing and appreciating every single frame revealed. So even though compared to a 2 minute trailer, 20 seconds isn't a lot, going from no footage to 20 seconds of footage would be a lot for fans to process for the next 2 months building up to CCXP. Now I still think that with David Corrensweet stating the movie starts promotion in winter this year, and in the southern hemisphere, then Brazil's CCXP makes more sense for us to see any footage from the movie. But I completely forgot that New York Comic Con was this weekend, and DC were going to be there. And with Gunn very recently becoming cryptic when talking about a Superman trailer, I can see how it would make sense for a teaser trailer to be released in New York. So I'm hoping that we get something Superman related this Friday, but expecting that we will only get footage at CCXP in December, which is still great and I am very excited for that event. But that's just my thoughts on this topic, and I'm hoping we get at the very least our first poster for the movie this weekend. But how likely do you think it is that we get a Superman teaser? at New York Comic Con? Let me know in the comments below. But that is all for today's episode of The Road to Superman. Thank you so much for watching. Please make sure to like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications so you never miss an episode. I hope to see you here again soon, so until then, have a great day. Bye!